Reigning horse of the year, Arrowgate starting what will be the first of three runs this year at Del Mar. The four-year-old Grey Colt warming up for the Pacific Classic with a run in the one and a 16th mile San Diego handicap. Trevor Denman has a stretch call. Arrogate from the back now. Mike Smith's having to push him along, but Arrogate starting to pick it up. Arrogate still has six to make up, though. They have a quarter of a mile to go and accelerate out here. We're looking at a massive upset. Arrogate is still far, far back in the four spot, and Accelerate has opened up. Accelerate is well cleared to Domworth. Arrogate just not in the mood today. Arrogate will finish far, far back, and it's Accelerate and Victor Espinosa. Clear by eight, nine lengths here. Accelerate romps home in the San Diego. Yeah, Arrowgate was a 1-20 to 20 favorite. Accelerate is your win of the four-year-old chestnut cold written by Victor Espinosa and trained by John Sadler paying 17.60. But the real numbers are in the place in the show. Was the last time you saw a horse in second place make you $119? The total bet on Arrowgate to win place in show, $2.45 a million. Here are the winning a jockey and trainer. Fun, fun, fun ride. Just easy cruise around the track. No pressure, nothing. I mean, I know I, ri I was riding against Arrogate, but no pressure for me. Well, I mean, you know, you want to win. You know, I, we don't concede anything. So, um, you know, I I'm surprised we won. I mean, because Arrogate's the best horse in the world. A um, couple things went right for us. Um, the two, the other speed horse, looks like the rider lost the irons and Arrogate maybe didn't fire his best effort today. So, I mean, that's what kind of has to happen for some of these big upsets. 2.45 million bet on that horse to win place and show. Your second stakes race, the Eddie Reed, were 250 grand. Trevor again. Homeward bound now. Ashley Love Sugar gets first run. Now there's a gap for Hunt. And Hunt comes through on the inside. Mr. Rory running a big one between them. Hunt on the inside, though, explodes the last hundred. And Hunt and Flavion Pratt have taken the Eddie Reed. Hunt is your winner, the five-year-old Grey Gilding, ridden by Flavian Pratt and trained by Philip D'Amato, paying eight a 60. The other action going on at Del Mar, the Chargers Appreciation Day for the Chargers of the 90s as the LA Chargers prepare for training camp to start next Saturday at Jack Hammett Sports Complex in Costa Mesa. Fans at the track are getting a chance to meet and greet with former San Diego Chargers, the football team, and what seems to like it's kind of been the longest goodbye in a sports franchise history. When it comes from the heart and so many things these fans did for us and the way they represented us and the way they represent us, right there. the way they represent us, the things they do for us, just amazing. When you uh, you come home and you see great guys, great fans, you see tattoos on their arms and charger emblems and just know that this is uh, that this place is they bleed San Diego and support us as as retired players and understand our frustration the fact the team's moved but we also understand it you know it's a business and uh dean spanos uh you know chose to make a business decision so but we're charges for life down here we're san diego charges and uh always will be doing the selfie down there what was that have you had that experience being that close to the horses that come I, out? no never you know what i've been in san diego for geez 20 years and this might have been my fifth time at the racetrack so uh, it was good to be that. All right, over at the Four Point Sheraton and Kearney Mesa World uh, Championship Muay Thai fights are taking place. The Costa Canyon alumnus Alex Higley making his Muay Thai debut facing Matt Erdoms in a super welterweight bout. The referee would stop the fight just before the end of the third round of the scheduled four round fight, awarding the decision to Higley, who wins his uh, debut. Matt, you know, I've had so many visualizations the week leading up to this. For me, I started training as a kid, did my first fight in San Diego in 93. So to be here now in 2017, when I was first stepping up to that ring, it just felt good. It felt, uh, I've done some MMA, but striking is my background. So stepping in for my first pro Muay Thai fight just felt amazing. And having the support that I had from everyone from Higley Fit Martial Arts to Jim Ione and Carlsbad, so many friends and family were here to support. It just felt so good. Congratulations to you, Alex. We go to the Pony League in the Mustang Super Regional in San Diego competitive versus Valley, a wide out of Hemet in first innings and in competitive's David uh, McCabe hitting the first of two home runs. This one flying so far. It's into the next field. Second inning, Noah uh, Figured connects for a two-run shot. 6-2 at that point, and the homers keep on coming. Two batters later, Sergio uh, Zazuela. It's a solo bomb. Five total homers as the defending nine and under World Series champs win it. 13 to 4.
It gives us a lot of confidence going into the next game, the game after that. And last year, we went 21-0 and won the World Series, and we got to keep that streak going. The San Diego Padres playing a day game in San